influential figures of the rock era. Only the lonely. Now, for the first time, all of Roy's greatest songs are together in one incredible collection. The very best of Roy Orbison. Tunnel comes with the extra long hose for a 20 foot reach and can be yours for five payments of $59.99 with free shipping and handling. If you order now, you'll also receive these special bonus items. Together, that's a $65 value free. So call now. I'd recommend it to anybody who asks me about a vacuum cleaner. I think you will get your money's worth. Unleash the power of the wind on your carpets and upholstery with a wind tunnel vacuum cleaner. To order or for more information, call now. I love who a wind tunnel. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, Tony Orlando and Dawn. Welcome to our, you're a fabulous audience tonight. We're in for a good show tonight. And just to start off things right, did you notice anything different? Truth about us tonight? Yeah. Notice the costumes? Yeah. Little? I mean, yeah, right. Normally I wear a black tuxedo, right? Yeah. And normally the girls both wear identical dresses, right? Yeah. A little bit different tonight, they're both wearing bird nests. <laughs> and that's because we wanted to give you a preview of what we will be wearing in this Sunday's Easter Parade. Sure thing, honey. Huh? Thelma and I will be strolling down the avenue. And he'll be on the corner next to his good humor truck. <laughs> Do I look like a good humor man? On second thought, you don't look like a good humor man. No? You look like a bottle of milk of magnesia. Oh. <laughs> you look beautiful. I'll overlook that. I'll o but I'm, I gotta tell you, really, I'm really impressed. Talma, you are going to be unbelievable in that parade on Sunday. Well, honey, you know I'm going all out. If I don't get a husband by sundown, I'm gonna shoot the Easter Bunny. <laughs> Right, Junior. What am I, chop chitlins? <laughs> I'm sorry, Joyce. I didn't mean to ignore you. I love that gown. Thank you. I it's, is it? Is that an original? Practically, it was worn just once by John Davidson. <laughs> you mean John Davidson wears the same size you do? Yeah. All I had to do was take in the bust a little. <laughs> well, next time, I got an idea for you. Borrow from Flip Wilson, because he's more your size. <laughs> 
Let's meet our guests, ladies and gentlemen. Without any further ado, as they say, first, the star of good times and a good, good friend. Will you please welcome Mr. John Amos. And a country and western star who is one of America's best singers, best talkers, best songwriters, Mr. Mel Tillis, ladies and gentlemen. And I'm happy to say, back for a return visit, on loan from Rhoda, McMillan and wife, our very, very special guest star, the fantastic Miss Nancy Walker. Yeah. City in Hollywood, it's Tony Orlando and Dawn, featuring Joyce Vincent Wilson and Thelma Hopkins, with tonight's guest stars John Amos, Mel Tillis, and special guest star Nancy Walker. For the great taste of ranch dressing, choose Hidden Valley Original Ranch. One pack of Hidden Valley Ranch with one stick soft butter and spread over two loaves French bread. Grill. Dive in. Hidden Valley Ranch. One packet, endless possibilities. Across America, when folks need dependable heating, they call Bryant to the rescue. 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Come on, Bryant, and rescue me, rescue me! You may not understand everything that comes out of his mouth, but with Sunny Delight, at least you understand what goes in it. To him, it's good. To you, it's good for him. What's not to understand? Sunny Delight, the good stuff kids go for. How do you get rid of ugly stains on ceiling tiles? You simply spray them away. Incredible? It's true with Instagon. Just spray it on and the stain is gone right before your eyes in less than 30 seconds. No scrubbing, no rubbing, no work at all. Instagon's unique patent pending formula disintegrates stains on contact. This textured ceiling is a real challenge. You'll rub off the pebbling before you wipe away the dirt. But Instagon gets rid of the problem in no time. Amazing! And stop wasting so much time on bathroom tiles. Even that grungy caulking between the tiles comes sparkling clean with Instagon. Stucco is just about impossible to clean. But Instagon gets into all those tiny crevices and dissolves the grime away. It'll even take care of those neglected fireplace walls. Just spray on Instagon and watch years of soot just disappear. Water stains on your walls and ceilings? Now you see them, now you don't. Instagon works like magic. And why scrub that PVC lawn furniture? Just give it a spray of Instagon and clean away months of dirt in seconds. It even gets rid of the mildew on those vinyl cushions. 
you just spray it away. For extra large stains, apply Instagon with a paint roller. It works safely. It works instantly on all these surfaces. Instagon is yours for only $19.95. But wait, call now and we'll double your order at no extra charge. That's two 22-ounce spray bottles good for hundreds of jobs for only $19.95. Guaranteed to make stains disappear or your money back. It's not available in stores, so order your Instagon now. Order Instagon now and receive an additional 22-ounce bottle of Instagon absolutely free just by calling 1-800-936-9100 or send check or money order for $19.95 plus $4.95 shipping and handling to Instagon, 809 Stewart Lane, Brentwood, Tennessee. But for quicker service, call 1-800-936-9100. Just think, huh? A week ago, we were four total strangers, each driving alone, an island unto himself. We didn't even know we worked in the same part of town. You know that? And now here we are, riding together, saving precious gasoline, and forging inroads of new friendship and good fellowship. My luck, the computer had to put me in a car with Billy Graham. <laughs> hey, hey, pilot the passengers. Pilot the passengers, how y'all doing back there? Be doing a lot better if you push your seat up, turkey. <laughs> and my toes are in rigor and my feet are in mortis. Good thing. Are you kidding? Anything for a happy ship? And you, Mama. If you just slide them cupcakes over, I could stretch out. What do you think this is, a freedom bus? If you want to stretch out, why don't you ride to work on a hearse? I know how they put such a big mouth and such a small head. No brains. Hey, come on, gang. Fun time. Fun time, remember? Hey, hey, hey. Quick. There's a uh shortcut. It'll it'll save us ten minutes. Where? Oh, you just turn right up. Where? You just turn right. Where? You just missed a turn. <laughs> Are you sure you're a teacher at Berlitz? Come on, Andy Granatella. You want to step on it a little bit? I can't step on it. There's heavy traffic up there. Did you hear that? That was a look at that. Boy. Look, let's do something, huh? Let's do something fun to pass the time while we're sitting in all this traffic. Yeah, why don't we scrap Granny to the grill and make believe she's a hood ornament? You look like a 48 Buick. All right, who knows a good joke? Hey, I got one. Yeah? It was these two girls. These two girls. I these heard it. I heard it. Miss Polinsky, do you know a good joke? I'm riding to work with three of them. <laughs> I really like that, Miss Polinsky. That was great. I got a fun idea. How about some car games? Games? Well, come, come on, on man. Will See, listen, I don't mean to be impolite, but uh, could you tell me what was the approximate time of death of whatever it is you have in this bag? I got information, sweetie. That happens to be my lunch. Yeah, well, I think you forgot to have it embalmed. Well, this happens to be a rare delicacy called uh, peanut butter and catfish. Oh. Or a Kaiser roll. Oh. Tell me something. Are you really going to eat that, or do you just carry it around to ward off vampires? <laughs> Hey, gang, I got a great idea. I got a great game, alphabets. Remember that? I'll start. A, my name is Andrew, and I come from Albuquerque. Yeah. B, 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 uh, <laughs> my name is B, B, B. No. New, new game, game, new game. <laughs> you know what your problem is, Cupcakes? You've never learned to appreciate gourmet soul cooking. Yeah, take a bite of this catfish. Oh, oh, all right, that does it. I got a game for us. Musical chairs. Hey, 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 hey. Oh, hey. no. Oh, oh, oh. Get your foot out of my left hand. Here. I Come can't on, say, Mrs. Balinski. I want your hands crushed. That wasn't my hand. It was the gear shift. You just missed the turn. Oh, sh just, sh 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 shut up. <laughs> can everybody calm down so we can play our game? Listen, let me explain something. I had a rough morning. My pants are ruined climbing around in this clown car. I was almost gassed to death by that catfish hunter back there. Hey. And Marble 
a mouth with a shortcut is driving me nuts. And for the first time in my life, I was attacked by a gear shift with a knob. Ready to work! But we'd have been there if he hadn't taken the wrong... The, uh, the wrong... Come on! <laughs> Yo -yo. Why don't you shut up and let the man talk, Cupcakes? I will, if his mouth will. Why don't all of you go take a uh, uh, poke at a pig with, with a pickle? What talk is that, man? This is a carpool. Oh, you don't talk like that in a carpool, man. All right, gang. Guess what? We've made it, OK? It's about time. All out, all out, and we'll meet back here after work 6.30. 6.30? I get through at 4.30. So you wait two hours. So uh, you wait four hours, Jack. I don't get out till 8.30. <laughs> what are you complaining about? I just remembered. Huh? It's my day off. <laughs> Goodness, tomorrow I don't drive. Tomorrow it's your turn. What do you drive? A taxi. <laughs> it's gonna cost you ten dollars. Yeah, by the ten. time you get it out, it'll be twelve. <laughs> Meine Damen und Herren. Translation. Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Heute Abend sollen wir die Musik von Schweizerland singen. Tonight we will sing for you the music of Switzerland. Und you will like it. <laughs> Come with us now to the Alps and meet our little Swiss mister. <laughs> there he is now. Either that or it's a moose with a toothache. <laughs> I see the cuckoo. <laughs> there he is, America. 168 pounds of solid liverwurst. You laugh. Ha! You jest. But tonight, I am dressed in the rugged attire. <laughs> say was I am dressed in the rugged attire of a Swiss mountaineer. In case you didn't understand it. The man climbs the Matterhorn, facing all the elements, and always, but always comes out on top. This is my Swiss rope. This is my Swiss pick. <laughs> this is my Swiss movement. Well, Tony, that explains you. Now tell us about your date. You need a Banaka Blast. <laughs> I, I can tell. I can, 
tell you now, you know nothing, nothing about Switzerland. I mean, for your information, we laugh at this friendly little Fritzy the goat here, right? But in Switzerland, we have full of goats. <laughs> my dear, are part of their atmosphere. Unfortunately, it's also part of this atmosphere. So what, have you, what have you got against the goat? Nothing. He's got nicer knees than you have. You know why I'm going to accept that insult? Because it so happens that I possess the hearty spirit of the Swiss people. That's right. I know what it is to ski the giant slopes of the Alps, to yodel to a distant skier, to communicate to a dumb goat. <laughs> I know what it is to yodel to a distant skier. Your name? Yodel? Yeah, like I yodeled just now when I came out here tonight. The difference was that you didn't yodel back. Well, give us another chance. You mean it? Yeah. All right. When I yodel a he, you yodel a he back. Okay. <laughs> Got it. Yodel a he. Now, let me hear you do that. Okay. <clears throat> You lay. Yes. How you got it? You lay, hello, lady, hello, lady, hello, lady. That was close. <laughs> All right, close. Now let me hear you do it. <coughs> Your lady show sure looks good to me. <laughs> Where in what part of Switzerland do they yodel like that? The southern part, better known as Swiss Mississippi. <laughs> hey, you, know, you see what I gotta put up with here? Every single week I gotta put up with this. I'm gonna do it for you, because you're the only one that understands me, okay? Mm -hmm. I'll yodel for you, you'll give me a kissy poo. <laughs> yodel <laughs> What do you think, Fritz? What do you think, sweetheart? What do you think? with the goat. <laughs> All right, no more fooling around. Are you ready? Rosie, ein, zwei, drei. Which means tocalo. Which means play it in Spanish. I shall now sing for you and the audience the mountaineering national anthem. I love to go a-wandering along the mountain track and as i go i love to see my knapsack on my back with my knapsack on my back i wave my hat to all i meet and they wave back to me and blackbirds sing they love to sing as all over the world we roam <laughs> With this. 
the remarkable filter inside the Brita water filtration pitcher virtually eliminates lead and chlorine. Your tap water suddenly tastes like this. Clear, fresh, wonderful. Brita. Tap into great taste. In the beginning, it's always the same little lullaby, the same special toy, maybe the same fancy diaper, even though it costs more. Uh, maybe not. Things change, <laughs> so change to Love's. They cost less, and now they've got this leak guard guarantee. See, Love's are so good on leaks, they're now guaranteed with a no-leaks phone number. Just call to find out how to get your money back. It's easy. Now, where else are you going to get a guarantee like that? I can't even guarantee I'll get a shower every day. Uh, Live and learn, and then get Love's. If you want cake so moist, you can see it here, here, and even here. You want Duncan Hines Moist Deluxe Cake, yellow, chocolate, or our perfectly moist new white cake. Duncan Hines, just what you want. Every year, we open billions of cans the same old-fashioned way, cutting the lid, leaving razor-sharp edges that are as dangerous as any knife. Finally, there's a revolutionary new product that will change all that. Introducing Safety Can, the only can opener of its kind in the world. Safety Can actually penetrates the seal of the can, leaving edges that are incredibly smooth and safe. Safety Can's advanced technology actually produces 100 pounds of cutting power, penetrating the seal of the can at precisely the right place, at the exact angle. You're left with smooth, safe edges. It's amazing! Look, old-fashioned can openers cut the lid of the can, dropping it into your food. That's dirty. Yuck! Even the blade touches your food. It's unsanitary. But Safety Can's new technology glides through the seal of the can, leaving incredibly smooth edges. And look at this. When there's pet food left over, the lid pops back on, with the can and lid still intact. It's the most incredible kitchen product ever invented. Safety Can's ergonomic design is easy on the wrist. It does all the work, gliding around any shape or thickness of can. So which do you prefer? Those razor sharp edges left on the lid and can? Or those smooth, safe edges with Safety Can. It's the world's safest opener. In fact, Safety Can is so amazing, it was awarded a United States patent. It was even named Great Britain's Kitchenware Product of the Year. Get your Safety Can today. Available through this special offer for the incredible price of just $19.95. But wait, call now and get the Safety Jar absolutely free. Why struggle with stubborn jars? Now you can open any jar or bottle with ease. Safety Can and Safety Jar, both for just $19.95. Safety Can. For safety's sake, call now. To order Safety Can, have your credit card ready and call 1 800 292 5200 or send check or money order for $19.95 plus $5.95 shipping to the address on your screen. Call 1 800 292 5200. Sorry, no CODs. Great song. Sister and brother, I dream about the girl who's been waiting for so long. I want to go home. I want to go home. Take it, man. Oh, Lord, I want to go home. That's how you do this song. All folks think I'm a big man. Freight train north to Detroit City. And after all these years, I find the 
that I've been just wasting my time. That's out of it. So I'll just take my foolish pride, Mel, put it on a southbound freight train and ride, and go back home to those old folks that I once left behind. I wanna go home. As we sit here, sometimes we forget, but while we're having fun here with the audience and kidding around and singing songs, a million poignant dramas are taking place around us. For instance, at this very moment as we speak to each other, a certain young lady is coming home to sadness, heartbreak, and other fun things. So stay tuned, and I guarantee there will not be a dry eye in America. Another heartbreak. Sweetheart, I'm leaving you. Stop. Goodbye forever. Stop. I've met a 19-year-old stewardess and we're never gonna stop. <laughs> 19 years old, what chance have I got? Even if she's a Labrador retriever, she's got me beat. Oh, why, why, why? What did I do wrong? I know what I did. I bought him glasses. <laughs> A stronger hand. Did he need a lighter touch? Was I soft or was I strong? Did I give enough? Did I give too much? If I gave any more, it'd have to be the Gabor sisters. <laughs> but at the moment that he needed me, did I ever turn away? So once in a while, I had a migraine headache. But would I be there if he called, if he walked into my life today? Would I be there? Does a shark need a water pick? Were his days a little dull? Were his nights a little wild? His nights wild. His idea of wild was watching Adam 12 with a diet Pepsi. <laughs> Did I overstate the man? Did I stress the plan? And forget the calm. 56 years old and he's still sucking his thumb. <laughs> oh, let it please be him. Oh, dear God, it must be him. It must be him. But it's not him. <laughs> and what are you? Pardon me, lady. I'm, I'm from Western Union. Listen, you deal with people. Let me ask you something. Should I blame the times I pampered him? Or blame the times I bossed him? Well, what should I do? Come on, what do you think? You can square with me. What do you think? Listen, am I bossy? Tell me I'm not bossy. Huh? Oh. What do you say? Come on. Oh, I'll ask myself my whole life long. You've known me long enough. Be honest with me. Would I be there? You're a good judge of character. Tell me, baby, would I be there? Excuse me, lady. You see, I just came back to pick up the telegram. I, I delivered it to the wrong apartment. <laughs> it wasn't for you. Not for me. You didn't mean this for me. You're a good man. Thank you so much. You are a good lady, man. Lady, you know what? You know man. what? I think I like the beating better. Oh. oh, the wrong telegram. My Sheldon hasn't 
left me. Of course he hasn't left me. Who would have him with a puss like that? <laughs> if he walked in has their dummy. <laughs> Here to present tonight's awards, the diva of design, the first lady of fashion, Mrs. Oscar de la Yenta. America. Get lost, girls. I walk alone. <laughs> the theme of tonight's award is the emergence of man as a fashion animal. A mere 15 years ago, man had all the style and chic of a dump truck. What's it like today? What can I tell you? Joe Namath is wearing pantyhose, and George Meany is wearing wedgies. <laughs> so, to honor the male fashion renaissance, the theme of our show tonight is man out of the closet. First, and this is for you cowboy buffs, and if you've ever tried to buff a cowboy, you know how painful that can be. To head us off at the fashion pass, here is Maurice of the Prairie. for unnecessary cheekness in this Jacques of Locker Room original. <laughs> and remember, you gotta be a football hero to have the guts to wear clothing like this. <laughs> Crack you 
made, man. And I heard what you said, now don't play that game. <laughs> and sandwiches in your cage. I know what the well-dressed gangster will wear. From the spring collection of Hoodlum Sophisticates, the Syndicate Silhouette. You'll be the hippest hitman in town in this I don't play that game either, man. Get a load of this smart ensemble. It comes complete with matching accessories. Notice the smashing handkerchief containing the complete text of the Fifth Amendment. You got that? Should you get the kids to death, you ready? See these fabulous alligator pumps? You slip on comfortably into cement. Voila! Right? A bulletproof vest. Watch. <laughs> See that? Not even a... Oh, jeez! <laughs> you wait for the button hole. What a shot! for the winner of this fabulous fashion freak out. smooth. But after the diaper goes on, the day goes on. The freshness fades. Isn't there a diaper designed to help keep skin soft and smooth? Actually, there is. Pampers Premium has a revolutionary new gentle touch liner, plus aloe, to give baby's bottom a special layer that helps protect against wetness. It has airflow sides, and the gentle touch liner means skin stays softer and smoother than before. Pediatricians know healthy-looking skin is soft and smooth. That's why Pampers Premium created the Gentle Touch Liner Plus Aloe. A diaper really can make a difference. If it's new Pampers Premium, pamper the skin they're in. America, when folks need dependable heating, they call Bryant to the rescue. 24 hours a day, seven days a week. Come on, Bryant, and rescue me, rescue me. Climb in and get cozy. 
I can get into that. And I'm not about to let a big, bulky pad get in the way. So I started using new Always Ultra Thin Overnights. When I lie down, they cover where my regular pad misses. They're longer front to back with wings that cover side to side. So I get better protection where I need it. And they're this thin. This is an idea I'm very comfortable with. New Always Ultra Thin Overnights. Cleaner, drier, better overnight protection. What's inside every box of Unisom? A great way to sleep from Pfizer, a leading research pharmaceutical company. Unisom helps you sleep with the same quality that's in every Pfizer product. Unisom, rest assured. <laughs> Kimmy Talk, there's a new show on nostalgia and I'm so excited, it's a real gem. And speaking of gems, yes, that's right, Joan, Cafe Du Art is a real gem, which is more than I can say for in your seatbelts. Cafe Du Art is going to be a funny ride. Listen, I'll tell you something funny. Did you hear how they caught the woman impersonating me? She kept leaving lipstick on my cigars. Hi, I'm Louise Duart, and those are just a few of the characters you'll meet at Cafe Duart. Join us along with special guests for an evening of music, comedy, and skits right here on Nostalgia Good TV. Make your reservations now for Cafe Duart. Sundays and Wednesdays at 7, Thursdays at 11. Exclusively on Nostalgia Good TV. Oh my, that's a wonderful. I'm going to tell Horchie all about it. Oh yes, oh, that's terrific. <laughs> I'm looking over a story over that I overlooked before. They've seen already one leaf of sunshine. The young kids rain. Take it away. I wrote some Easter poems for everybody here and everybody at home. Give me a break. Tulips are yellow. Crabgrass is brown. <laughs> Happy Easter to all from Tony Orlando and down. Try again. A rose is a flower, a penny is a coin. Have a happy Easter from Tony Orlando and Doyne. <laughs> you guys are crazy, you'll pop for anything. This is a killer. You paint Easter eggs for the Easter festival, but don't eat them all. They're full of cholesterol. <laughs> Looking over a four leaf clover that I overlook before. Sing it out till I can hear you. Up on your feet. Come on, up, up, up. Sing it out, come on. I'm looking over a four leaf clover that I overlook before. Since it's Easter and that has a holiday feeling, I gotta ask somebody if they want to do a poem, all right? Hold the plots, hold the claps. See if somebody's got a poem to do. Here we go. Dinka, 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 dinka. Here you go. Here you go. I got a poem for this man right here. Go ahead. Easter means clothes, painted eggs. Start again, because I didn't have the mic in, in front of you, okay? What is your name, sir? Burton. Bob. Hi, uh, Burton. Hi. I love that green shirt you're wearing. Thank you much. Yes, indeed. Springtime time. Yes, sir. Okay. You look right at that camera right there with the big yellow ribbon on it and the red light. And go ahead. Okay. Easter means clothes, painted eggs, and a bunny. 
So happy Easter to all from Joyce, Thelma, and Tunny. I'm looking over a after me, please show, sir, and if the new app got the same. Give me a pretty, pretty introduction to this Easter bonnet time. Oh, I could write a sonnet about your Easter bonnet. He had a poem. And I thought that I would say goodnight to you all. On behalf of John Amos, thank you for being here. Nancy Walker, God bless you for being here. Bell Tillis, rabbit. You get the blood rolling? On the next Issues and Answers, affirmative action, America's most divisive... Might be worth a fortune or not. So gather up your collectibles and join me for the flea market movie, weekdays at 2 on Nostalgia. Weeknights starting at 8 with Star in the Streets of San Francisco. It all starts weeknights at 8 on Nostalgia. Take stock of your portfolio with our leading market indicators, the bull and the bear. Wall Street experts Richard Chan and Llewellyn King offer a thumbs-up, thumbs-down review on viewer calls regarding specific stocks and market trends. Plus, they'll share their picks for the week's hot stocks. So exercise your options. Call 1-800-255-3080 and get expert advice from the bull and the bear. Weekdays at 5.30 on Nostalgia. Weeknights, enroll in the Rockford School for Private Eyes and learn private eye philosophy. Is there anything you won't do for money? Well, there's two things. I, uh, I won't kill for it and I won't marry for it. Other than that, I'm open about anything. Private eye physics. Two inches to the right and you'd be missing that eye. Ah, oh, yeah, but look at it this way. Two inches to the left, you'd have missed me completely. Private eye wisdom. Never believe anything you hear in the men's room. The Rockford Files. Weeknights at 9 on Nostalgia. Good TV. Nostalgia Moments, staying sharp. The way I keep my mind sharp is by being with younger, challenging people because they may be naive, uninformed, but they also ask those direct questions that cut to the heart of important issues. And by staying young, by being with the young, that is the true found of you. Please make love and sex glamorous. Help them make some real life happy endings. Dennis Holy has a one-on-one -on -one discussion with noted author.